News now. This is breaking news. Now, breaking news is on the east end of Waikiki tonight, where Kapiolani Park was the best choice for a pilot with few options. He made an emergency landing on the grass, coming to a stop just feet from a tree. Our Dylan and Chetta is live at the scene where witnesses could not believe what they were seeing. Dylan? Aloha, Stephanie, Keahi, thank you so much. Yes, this is an unusual site here at Kapi'olani Park this afternoon. We're located right between the Waikiki Shell and the Kapi'olani Bandstand. I'm going to step out of the way so you can take a look. As you can see, the plane is still here, and in fact, mechanics are just starting to take a look at it. Now, the small aircraft came dangerously close to two trees, but stopped just short of any of the wings colliding into them. Now, officials telling us two people were on board, and the good news here is that no one was injured in this incident. Both of those people on board were able to make it out safely. I spoke to them off camera and they did not want to do an interview, but overall they said they are fine. They are just shaken up. We've also been getting witness videos of the plane coming down and right now some youth sports teams are filling into the park, but all of this happened just before 3 p.m. And thankfully at that time there was not a lot of people here at the park, mostly just individuals enjoying the day. I did speak with one man who was was actually taking a nap under one of these trees when he heard alarming sounds from the engine of the plane. He said it made a loop around the park and then he saw it coming directly for him. The engine was sputtering pretty bad and right when I got up I said I knew something was wrong and I just watched it and when it did the loop and when it came down here I knew just to get out of the way and I ran to safety and yeah it was pretty it was pretty intense but you know good thing Everyone's safe, so that's the only thing that matters. Now, according to Flight Aware, this light sport aircraft left Daniel K. Inouye Airport at 2.20 p.m. Its flight path was out east toward Maui before it turned back around. In all, this flight lasted 32 minutes. And records show this aircraft is owned by Bell Air Pacific out of Haleiwa. Now, back out here live, the police tape is still up, and we have some curious onlookers here in the park coming to take a closer look at this aircraft. But again, the good news is no injuries here, and the mechanics... They're just starting to take a closer look at this aircraft. But for now, the plane is staying put right where it is. At Kapiolani Park, I'm Dylan Enchato, Hawaii News Now.